Hi viewers, welcome to this month's support group. I am here with our dietitian, Sheila Bo, and she is going to discuss some ways on how you can cut your carbs. Yes, um, cutting back on carbohydrates can have major benefits for your health. Many studies have shown that low carb diet can help you control your diabetes or pre-diabetes and even lose weight. And here are some tips to cut back on the carbs. First, you want to eliminate sugar sweetened drinks. And uh, secondly, you want to cut back on bread, cereal, or pasta, any kinds of food that's made of flour or grains. And third, stop drinking fruit juice. Fruit juice, not only it has a lot of sugar, it does also, uh, it doesn't have any fiber benefits or vitamins. Um, use sweeteners instead of sugar. Sweeteners are zero calories and therefore it's okay to have uh, you know maybe not too much too much of anything is never good and next uh, ask for vegetables instead of potatoes or bread at restaurants uh, whenever you're getting ready to order your meals you can always substitute uh, with anything that you ask for emphasize non-starchy uh, vegetables and i'm going to talk a little bit more on to that uh, point eat healthy high protein foods and I have found uh, some recipes online. Uh, the first website that's really good is www.mydomain.com and they have uh, recipes like baked eggs in stuffed peppers. You can do this for breakfast or enchilada stuffed zucchini boats uh, and pesto asparagus noodles. You can always add your own protein of choice. And the second uh, website that I found that's really, really helpful is www.delish.com. They have uh, Asian chicken lettuce wraps, taco tomatoes, chicken parmesan stuffed peppers, eggplant lasagna, cheese stick stuffed peppers, and loaded cauliflower bake. Okay, so that sounds really great. So most of these dishes that call for pasta, potatoes, and bread uh, can then be substituted with some vegetables such as pepper, zucchini, cauliflower, eggplant, tomatoes, lettuce, and cabbage. That's right. That's going to be your best uh, vegetable substitute since they are non-starchy. So if you would like to substitute meat with some protein substitute, you can try some tofu or vegetable patty to prepare the dishes instead of using turkey or beef or chicken. That will be another alternative that you can do. Have fun in trying the new recipes. Awesome. Thank you so much, Sheila. Thank you.